Science Centre we celebrate today has been named the Father Michael Ross Science Centre in honour of Father Michael Ross who taught physics, maths and astronomy for 30 years at the school. Make it become a centre where students and teachers imbued with the words of truth will search for the wisdom that guides the Christian life and strive wholeheartedly to stand by counsel their teacher who lives and reigns forever. Amen. The words we see in here, uh, they are my systems and control group. They specialize in electronics, uh, mechanisms and structures. So they are working on some, uh, on some little projects at the moment. They will explain some of them, will explain to you what they are doing. So this young man is went on to the Right. So he took his uh, old old plan, his previous, and then he modified it, put a frame on there. Okay. So this is where you put your, your laptop on there. You're sitting on your desk here, working on it. You plug this USB on there. The fans will automatically turn on to cool the, um, the laptop. So he's wake, if he's working in his bedroom at night and then you know sitting you know he wants to put some some mood lights on there, put some mood lights on there. Okay. So so these boys these boys they also do um, mechanisms, okay, mm -hmm. as part of their DT uh, projects. So he done his model. Father Ross arrived at St George's College in 1967 and taught here until 1997 when he retired. He passed away in the year 2001, he had been alive and is now buried at Chisha Washington. He was no doubt a very good teacher who won the admiration of his students who fondly remember him as Father Knight Power. I'm honored and privileged to be here at the official opening of the St. George's Science Center built by the Jesuits within the Catholic Church. The establishment of this science center resonates with my government's drive to encourage and support the learning of science subjects in our quest to promote local innovation, science and technology in line with modernization and industrialization agenda, which we have adopted under the Second Republic. I applaud the Jesuits for the investment in education and the development of the human capital base in our country. Well done to you, St. George's. With these remarks, I declare the St. George's Science Center officially open. This is going to be a hub for the Jesuit network and for Catholic schools within Zimbabwe. This platform offers us an opportunity to then re replicate in other institutions. Of course, it comes at a huge cost and not everyone is going to be able to afford it. And so we are going to offer the teachers a resource center to see. So teachers and learners can come here and can learn from what is happening on the spot. Thank you.